Uh, their fee related earnings rose 29 percent, but their principal investing income from selling private equity assets was terrible. Um, what did we learn from Apollo today? Everyone should sit in your and my conversations in the morning here because we're talking about the doldrums <laughs> in private equity. And uh, we, we were emailing on this, this is true. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so, you know, for Apollo, boy, are they coming out on top here. There were a lot of doubts when they first bought Athene, but now they're showing you that this insurance business combined with Apollo is letting them earn a lot in terms of spread income. Mm -hmm. This is the Apollo business model. Even if private equity is under pressure, they're really pushing hard to show you that they can be a lender to investment grade deals that now higher yields. And so they are being able to make a lot of money off that spread in lending. But to your point, the private equity business alone, principal investing is in a really sore spot. There are a lot of questions about what's happening inside the current portfolios, not just from Apollo, but every major private equity firm. And and how much life support they need to put these companies under and how much that might start to take away from the booming nature of these other businesses. Today though, Apollo is absolutely soaring. The stock is up the most in many, many months. And uh, it is all because of that big bet on private credit and mm -hmm. spread income that they've made.